Hello everyone. Welcome once again to another video of aviation math. And today we will solve another general navigation mathematical problem. Question 14 in the GMC series. The question states on a direct Mercator projection at latitude 45 degrees north, a certain length represents 70 nautical miles. At latitude 30 degrees north, the same length represents approximately and the four options are as given below. So let us look at the diagram and understand what the question is asking. This is 0 degree equator and same is represented like this on the Mercata. This is 30 degrees north on the actual earth or globe and this is 30 degrees north on Mercata. This is 45 degrees north on actual globe or earth and this is 45 degrees north on Mercata. So, what you will appreciate from this diagram that at 45 degrees north, a certain distance x represents a certain, suppose it is 70 nautical mile, then the same x at 30 degrees north would represent a greater than 70 nautical mile. It is maximum at equator, that means whatever is represented in Mercata, the same is on earth or globe. However, as you keep going northward, suppose you take at north pole 90 degrees, then you find that it is this distance will actually represent 0. So, it is actually a cost function. That means cost lat into distance is approximately what you is what you would get. So, here cos 0 is equal to 1, so it is the same distance at equator and cos 90 is equal to 0, so therefore it becomes 0. So, to get what is this greater than 70 distance, we have to find the ratio of cos multiply this 70 by ratio of cos 30 upon cos 45 into 70. is equal to 1.224, which is the value of this into 70 is equal to 85.732 nautical mile or approximately, approximately 86 nautical mile, which is our answer. Now, if you are confused whether to keep cos 30 on top or cos 45, remember if your value you want to get is more than 70, then make sure this ratio is more than 1. That is all that you have to remember, that logic. And if like in the question it was asked, 30 was given and 45 was given, then you have to make sure this ratio is less than 1. As long as you remember this logic and this diagram and the logic behind this calculation will not go wrong. So, option B which is 86 miles uh, nautical miles is the correct option. If you like the video, remember to press the like button and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching the video and happy landing.